Hello everyone, it's Hex here, HXX, and uh, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much wherever you are right now clicking on this video. I appreciate you. Uh, you're welcome to my YouTube space for giving me your time and having me on your screen right now. You are truly welcome. Um, if you're new here, I'm an African first of all. I'm a singer, a songwriter, a rapper, a beat maker, and a uh, music connoisseur. And uh, today we will be diving into another reaction video. And this one is from the Blackpink member called Jisoo. And um, this is called Flower. So, um, yeah, we'll be diving in right now. I think uh, I think it was a year ago. Yeah, I think it was a year ago we dived into. I think it was um, Lisa. So now we'll be diving into Jisoo. Because of obviously, it's all about music exploration. So we'll see what um, she's all about. What vibe she brings to the table. Just before we do, as always, Hex Music Madness Playlist. 2021 2022 and 2023 uh, it's still available you know i keep updating it um with new music for you guys and as we uh um, enter the new year as well as we enter the new year technically we're in the new year so um we're still going in we're still diving in and um i'll try my best to keep updating it with um, new music for myself yours truly you want to tap in it's H-E-X-X, not only on this platform, but on any stream or streaming platform out there that you're on. Feel free to tap in and show your boy some love. You know how we do. Having said that, don't forget to like this video. You know, it helps the algorithm. Comment your thoughts. Um, what part of the song you liked. What you were expecting. Just pour out your emotions right there. <laughs> I'll try my best to reply to every one of you guys. And most of all, hit that subscription button if you haven't. And hit that notification as well so again that's fine when i post a new song or post a new reaction video you know how we do so let's get started this one is just so and this is called flower let's see okay
interesting. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> um, where did I even start? Hmm. Okay, first things first. Um, the beat was very quiet. I mean, very quiet. It wasn't too extravagant. It wasn't too blaring. Um, it was quiet and um, gave space for her vocals. So throughout the whole song, I think the idea wasn't for the listener to concentrate on the um, the beat. Actually, the idea was for us to concentrate on her, which is why our vocals were um, taking the lead in this one compared to um, the usual equilibrium of the beat and the voice or sometimes the beat overshadowing the voice in poor um, productions but most of the time um, if um, the producer wants to have your attention it's more or less like the vocals coming in before the beat and then the beat is kind of like in the background just supporting um, but um, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say that it completely overshadowed the voice because of the little pockets in the whole song where the beat was left to breathe, which is kind of cool. And um, I like that. So um, the beat in general was okay, but it wasn't really... It was when it went to the, um, the chorus that it started to get a bit catchy and all that. But in general, it was really nice. It was cool. Um, I think the main thing was um, the lyrics and obviously vocals as well um, that carried the, the song for me. It was kind of interesting the linkage between like, um, we all know it was, it was definitely a love song, but the way um, it was passionate on one end, it was aggressive in the other, it was tender in one end, and then it was subtle in the other as well. Um, which is what I liked about the lyrics and um, the way it kind of, because of a flower, a flower is gentle, a flower is subtle, a flower is soft, a flower uh, uh, um, gives off a nice fragrance. Um, I like the way the lyrics mimicked emotions uh, in terms of the subtlety or, or mimic emotions and blended it or mirrored the characteristics of what a flower is with emotions, if you get what I'm trying to say, which is really nice because of at the end of the day, it's all about being creative in your writing and the fact that you can be able to outline the characteristics of a flower and then mirror that with emotions, love, and lyrics at the same time shows some excellent songwriting. So that was good. And most of all, I think the video itself, when it first started, I was like, oh, the, the wide windows and all that, it's kind of giving me uh, um, a European vibe to it. And I, and when she was now in the street, I was like, oh, well, there you go. So probably the video was probably shot somewhere in Europe. I may be wrong. I may be wrong. But uh, um, the, the columns in the background and the buildings uh, were given that. But technically, on the other hand, in this day and age, <laughs> it could have probably been... In Korea right there and um, on the set of a movie set and they could have just built up everything so you never know you never know at the end of the day we can pretty much replicate anything we want and in anywhere at all um, so but I think the video was quite catchy uh, because I was entertained all through and I know that the video definitely they must have tried their best in the video because of there were so many scenes with so many costumes that she was wearing, so many dresses she was wearing, so definitely must have spent like probably a week, I believe, shooting this video. This three minute video that we just watched right now probably must have spent a good amount of time on it. But the colors, the costumes, what she wore, and then um, in the little pocket there, the, the, the little dance that they were doing right there, the choreography was really... <laughs> Kind of cute and funny at the same time, um, but I, I, I liked it. Um, and obviously, the the black dress with the red blindfold that was kind of creative as well and pretty cool. But in general, it was it was definitely entertaining. Um, obviously, I'm guessing this is uh, um, 
just um, just it was time to obviously come out as a, a singer in her own right. So I guess everyone, every member of the group, they're trying to push every member of the group out to kind of like have solo careers. So um, this is Jisoo's vibe that we've that we've seen right now. So it's more or less like kind of like a slow, uh, kind of like an R and B sort of um, vibe with a little hint of pop in there. So I think probably I'm gonna dive into a couple more of her songs and just see how the vibe goes. But so far, Flower, it's definitely all right. Definitely feels good. Calm, sweet, and, and kind of cute at the same time. <laughs> um, I hope you liked it. If you did, please give a thumbs up. Comment your thoughts in the comment section below. Most of all, hit that subscription button and the bell notification so you get notified when I post a new song, post a new reaction video. And most of all, if you want to support the channel, PayPal link is below. Or you can use the super chat, super thanks. And um, Hex Music Man, this playlist is right here for you guys. Feel free to check your boy out and show your boy some love. And I'll catch you in the next reaction video. Stay safe and love.